Hey everyone, Sao here. Today's adventure brings us into the blistering cold weather of winter Chinaris. If I was to survive in these harsh conditions, I'd have to maintain warmth and avoid being seen, both challenges I wouldn't be alone in trying to achieve. I gave myself a goal, and that was to become a winter sniper, keeping my distance from other players when necessary, and picking them off one by one. We begin on the coast between Electra and Cherno, and as always, I hope you all enjoy. just run away from them. Let's go to Electro. Oh, Mary Chicken. That's what I thought. I'm dying. Alright. I think from here, if we follow the road to the summer camp, then maybe go to story. That might be the move. I'm not going to bother checking them. We'll keep moving. <coughs> hmm. Someone's been through. <coughs> Head torch. We do need that. Is it damaged? No. Okay, perfect. He had one in his pockets as well. The Roy should be just over here. I frostbite on my flipping face, man. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, we need to make a fire. Uh, okay. I, w I will gladly take it. Uh, there's a dead guy there. I do need a fire, but then I'm kind of not sure if I do it here. If someone's just died here. He's been stripped. Mind you, I don't think I have a choice, really. <coughs> yeah, we're gonna have to do it. <laughs> Shotgun. <coughs> oh! Oh! <coughs> Alright. Oh, he flipping stinks. The thing is, I feel like someone's killed two. Two of them, right? Because I don't think this guy killed um, the one outside. You wait for the buff, then go. There we go. <coughs> we need to get up the hell over this way. Oh, there's a guy over there. He is injured bad. Look at how much he's limping. He's a bit like me. He's sanitary. I mean, I'm not going to shoot him because he looks hurt. 
I might try and help him though. The lucky thing is, he shouldn't be too hard to track with the fact he's moving at like a snail's pace. <coughs> and I shouldn't have to worry too much about him because, well, one shot from my pistol will probably end up doing the job. There's a lot of shots over that way too. He's right over that way in that pine tree somewhere. Hmm. Do you reckon he stopped over here to make a fire? <coughs> yeah, I mean, it's, it's either that or you went to the piano house. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's him. <coughs> At least I think it's him. Gee, no, it, it can't be because I would have heard the actual shot. I think he's further away, the person that shot at me. I reckon he's up in that tree line, you know. Hello? Dude, if, if you're the guy who's limping in here, you need to run right now. There's a guy with a big gun suppressed. He's coming away. I'm going to go over here. I think if I can get one tree line between me and him, because I, I assume he's over in that one that I saw. With the lack of decent weaponry and my original plan to help the other survivor out of the window, I had to move on to keep myself alive. It's a gas bomb. Where though, I don't know. Yeah, I'm thinking we check the castle, look for a Winchester. If we get lucky, that'll be awesome. <coughs> Should probably load this up. Now that I had a somewhat capable long-range weapon, I took another risk in heading further north towards Severograd to continue searching for extra supplies. <coughs> That's only just down here. Might have been shooting an animal. Nope, they killed a guy. Never mind. They didn't kill a guy. They have a flipping snowmobile. Maybe they killed a guy? I don't know. Go into the military. He's got a Winchester. I mean, they were looting <coughs> behind this, which makes me think maybe they killed a guy there. And I don't see why they'd shoot one zombie. I mean, if I'm going to make a move, I need to make it quick. I have a feeling this might end bad. Because I, I need to kill them and then get their food before uh, before I start dying too much. <coughs> that was my chance. That was my flipping chance. I need to shoot the one without the helmet. In the head. of that is so bad <coughs> why do you have to move right as I shot <laughs> There. How far is that? About 200? I don't want to shoot that one because he's got a helmet on and I won't be able to kill him if I do. <coughs> Aim in. Where's the other one? Oh, 
I need this to like stop still. He's uncom. <coughs> he went inside the shed. I mean, there's two of them. I, I can't really push that. I don't think. Maybe I could try and make him run by shooting into the shed from, like, out here. I mean, the thing is, I don't think the other one's in there. <coughs> Screw it. I've got two shots with my double barrel. If I don't kill them now, I ain't killing them ever. I need to see if I can get an angle on the guy inside the house, if there is one in there. really stupid. I should not be pushing this. <coughs> I killed him through the shed! I cannot believe that shot. I can't believe that. Oh, he's amazing with the PU as well. These guys were pretty kitted. So they'd killed a... They'd killed a cow. That's what they'd done. But yeah, that's got to be the luckiest shot I've ever hit. <laughs> I don't think I'm toughing that one. <laughs> Maybe I could try and make him run by shooting into the shed from, like, out here. I think the guy had a rule as well. The one that I'd shot through the, uh, the shed. He did oh, I hit him in the head! That's an all gay R. X. He had so many batteries. He must have been alive for a long time. No meds, though. Other than the multivitamins. We'll do that for the water. <coughs> uh, I think that's about it, right? But you can wear that. Oh. Hmm. Let's go. <coughs> There's two.
I think I got one of them. Oh, good shot. I need to take him at further range. I have a Winchester. He only has a little, um, what's it called? SSG. Need to wait for the right shot. <coughs> that one there. Now, I don't know if he's got a friend. Another one. So there were two of them. To me, it kind of looked like he, maybe he was scouting out for another person. I don't know if I did kill his friend or not. He might have only gone uncom. Should be doing this with York. I got them both! <coughs> they had wolves come over. Yeah, I wonder how long they were watching me for. I think that's about all I really need off this one. The guy over here looked a bit more kitted. Yeah, definitely. But they were battery rich. Let's go. That's from the airfield. Is that? <laughs> yeah, no, I, I want to get rid of the cold. <coughs> I want to go to Navaya. If we head over to Navaya, check out the blue little medical. Cure our cold, that would be good. <coughs> yeah, that's a big fight. How did I not see that on the way in? Oh, 
I don't know if they're in here or not. Where would you go from here? I mean, they can't be far. Did I open this door? Or was that already open? I think it was already open, right? If it's already open, I think he's come up this way. Towards Tissy. I'm gonna check the house over here. Where else can I go that would have a medical? There isn't one by Sinistock, is there? I could do Vibor. Ooh, the hunting up north. We'll do that. What's up this way? It's a lot of shots. I reckon we check that out. I feel like the shots were towards the tent side. Alright. Tissy's only just up here. I think the move here is find where the dead bodies are that they've been shooting there. And then work off of that. Someone's parked a car. all the flipping parts. <coughs> they can't be far. I don't think I'll take the car. Mainly because if I move it, they'll know. I kind of want them to feel like they don't have anyone else to worry about. There's a dead guy. They're probably in this tree line with me. I mean, unless they're in that building. There are zombies still outside. I'm dying of cold here. <gasps> He's been shot and killed from here. I think I see someone inside, you know. I saw some movement. Like a tiny bit around this bit. Although I don't know if that is a player or not. Could just be the lighting. I mean, the thing is, right, I feel like they're more likely to, instead of being this one, be in that one, if they're going to be anywhere, right? Hanging around this kind of uh, location. Because you wouldn't really sit in the building right beside where you've killed someone, would you? Yeah, I'm dying of cold again. It's a shame we were just alright. But now that this is the cold event, we're in a bit of trouble. I want to make a move now. Investigate a little bit more. AK. Let's go double barrel. Yeah, they've been through. They've dropped stuff. Hmm. 
do you reckon they actually went for the car? <laughs> the Tetra he's got is ruined. You're joking. The thing that would have cured my flipping cold. Maybe they've gone to the tents now. I'm... I don't know. Man, the only thing is all the zombies are here. And the zombies at that shed, they were dead and still there. So I don't think he's come down this way. I think he went back to the car. I must have been really close to him. Yeah, I'm still dying. I think if I check by the car, if, if the car's still there, I'll take it. Because if I can go in the car, I'll get the buff. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll turn the heater on in the car. I don't think the car's there anymore, you know. I think it's actually gone. Because I can't see it from where I am right now. Yeah, the car is there. Should we just steal the car? Alright, let's go for it. There were multiple people in this. The people, the uh, back seats down. Wait, did they come back and take the flipping spark plug? No. Was it not running? Is the battery out? Oh, you're joking. There's stuff all over the floor. They've just died. That that wolf has just died. I don't think those bodies last for that long. Hello? Anybody? problem with trying to listen out for footsteps is every time I stand still, right, I'm just going to keep coughing and sneezing. The move for me really is just to keep moving and hope that I can catch them off guard. Here's someone outside. Unless it's ambience. Hey, uh, listen. I left my wallet in here. Uh, you, you haven't seen it, have you? Uh, I'll take this and I. There's flipping no one here. I think... Do we go make a fire now? Get the buff? Then try and find these guys? Or do we risk it? Hope we don't get too cold and go find them now? I think I'll go make a fire now. Then go find them. Bodies despawned. That's unfortunate. We'll get down this way.
two people here. I think they're in that crate. Could grenade it, but then it's it's not going to go through the crate. I have to kind of wait for them to um, open up that crate door. I mean, I could always sneak up over the door and spray them down, but then they'll probably hear me as I'm coming up. I might get close. Yeah, I I can't risk that. If if I if I sneeze, that's me um compromised. I think it's just better to wait here. Cuz we know they're sneaking around. They they're, they're taking their time. They're not rushing. There you go. We know what they're going for. I'll go around this way. Yeah, what what should be the moment they move? The second I come over here. doesn't help it's turning dark Good job I moved around, eh? They were very kissed. I think he was trying to make a timber for it. Wait, he had the flipping timber wolf. Okay. I see we use that. That'll be useful. 74 as well. Right, let's get out of here. Enough messing around. I think we still go check that heli crash out. I just want to check up here real quick. On the off chance that it is up here. It is up here. Did I grab the LAR mag? I did. Ooh. 
I think I have to take it. I mean, really, it would be stupid not to take it. After looting the helicopter crash site, I decided to head towards the east as I hadn't been that way yet. With myself starting to die to the cold as well, a little pub on top of a nearby hill seemed my best bet to make a fire. We'll make a fire. I just heard someone swap out something. I swear I heard someone. Maybe not. It sounded like someone swapped from, um, well, like maybe a gun to a grenade. Or a grenade to a gun. Now, my journey was close to coming to an end. I'd been on for quite a few hours and needed to go and eat some food before going to bed. I'd done a lot this life, and wanted to continue again with what I'd gained from the other survivors' stories that I'd cut short. But, it was only a matter of time before the cycle continued, and my own story suffered the same fate. Oh! Don't, please, please, 